Hi, my name is Andrew McCleary and I'm the builder of the EV GT40, an all-electric GT40 replica. This car started its life as a 1968 Fiberfab Valkyrie, a kit car based on the GT40 of that era. When I purchased it off of eBay for $500, I basically got a nice fiberglass body that had been sitting out in the rain for a number of years, as well as a rusted frame. I took apart what had been done and started over from scratch. From that frame, I rebuilt it back up as an all-electric vehicle. This car's got a top speed probably somewhere over 130. Haven't had it up to 130 yet, but I've had it up over 100 and it's handled quite well. Let me give you a quick tour of the car. Okay, we'll show you the car. First, to start off with, the doors have got Lamborghini doors. This is something my kids uh, thought would be fun. Actually cost me about three months of fabrication to be able to get it to work right but it makes it for a lot of fun and makes it an exciting looking car. Back in the back is where all the real action happens. Back here, we've got the battery pack. It's got a solar panels on the top that basically provide, provide cooling for the entire system. So as it's sitting out here in the sun, like bright day like today, you kind of hear a fan running that's pulling, that's pulling heat out of the batteries and out of this back compartment, keeping the back compartment pretty cool. Even as I put my hand back in here right now, this entire compartment has remained relatively cool despite sitting out here in the sun. This pops up, allows easy access to the battery pack. So I can easily get in and service any one of the cells. From here, you can see the battery pack and you can see how it's easily serviced. As you'll notice, there's small wires that connect to each battery. These connect back to the BMS system, which is from Vintage Voltage. This was produced by a friend of mine, Charlie Malone. Charlie and I have been working on this system together. He's doing the hardware and I'm doing the software. So we have a software interface that runs right off the screen in the in front of the car. 